I'm Mike Colombo with Make Magazine, and I just read an article by Heather Murphy in the New York Times who said that uh, NSA whistleblower Edward Snowden recently had some Chinese lawyers visit him, and he requested that they put their cell phones into the refrigerator, thinking that it would act as a Faraday cage that could block any signals so that they wouldn't be surveilled while they were having their dinner. And I thought about this, and I thought I was going to try it out. So what I have here are two cell phones. They're both Samsung Androids. And I'm going to put one into my refrigerator right here. And I'm going to use the other phone to call it. Here we go. Do you hear it? So, I guess that didn't work, did it now? Boy, I hope Snowden's okay. Now, when I read the article, another thing that I read was a, uh, a quote by a, uh, a designer in uh, counter surveillance by the name of Adam Harvey. And he said that a cocktail shaker works really well as a, um, as a Faraday cage. So I just happen to have a cocktail shaker right here. So uh, let's give it a try. We put the phone inside the cocktail shaker. Let me end my first call. There we go. And now we're going to try calling it. Here we go. And I don't hear any ringing. What do you know? It went straight to voicemail. Let's just be sure and check the phone here. And as you can see, there have been no missed calls on my phone. So if you want to make a Faraday cage so that uh, the government doesn't surveil you, don't use a refrigerator, use a cocktail shaker. I'll drink to that. I love science.